Hi everyone, in this video, we are going to look at the difference between hope and wish. In some languages, hope and wish are similar, but in English, hope and wish are different. We use them in different situations for different reasons. So, the basic difference between hope and wish is that hope is for something that we believe is possible. When we hope something, we truly believe that it's going to happen. Okay, But wish is for something that is not possible. And when we wish something, we truly believe that it's probably not going to happen. However, in this video, I'm going to focus on the different ways that we can use hope. I'm not going to speak about wish too much in this video because I just want to keep it short. But I will make another video in the future where we will focus more on wish. Now let's look at the first way that we can use hope. We can use hope plus present simple. When we use hope plus present tense, it sounds and looks like that we are talking about the present. Now but we are not. We are actually talking about the future. But it just looks like a present tense because of the grammar. Now here we have two examples. I hope I win the race. I hope I pass a test. In both of these situations, we use the present form of the verb. But we are actually thinking about the future. You can also use hope to verb to talk about the future. And when you use hope to verb, you are actually focusing on yourself, your goals for the future. For example, I hope to win the race. I hope to pass the test. So, I hope I and I hope to basically mean the same thing. I hope to sounds more active and more positive. It sounds like you have a goal that you are focused on and you are going to work hard for that goal. But when you just say I hope I, it sounds like yeah, I just want that to happen. But maybe I am not going to do anything about it. I will see if I am lucky. Also, when you use hope plus present simple, you can hope something for another person. For example, I hope she likes it. I hope you have fun. But you cannot do this with hope to verb. You can only do this with hope plus present simple. We can also use hope plus past tense to speak about something that finished recently but we are not yet sure about the result. For example, I hope you had fun. It means that you finished something recently and you haven't told me yet if you had fun. But I hope you had fun. Second example, I hope I said the right thing. It means that I know what I said to her, but I am not sure if it was the best thing to say. We will find out, we will see if she is happy or if she is angry. But I hope I said the right thing. Yes, there are a few more ways that we can use hop. But I just wanted to keep it short, so I gave you only the most common ways that we use hope. I hope you enjoy this video. I hope you watch my next video on wish when I make it in the future.